Alright, what is going on guys? Today we are watching Free Ren Beyond Journey's End episode 14. In the last episode we had Sain or Sain join the squad. Man is a priest, which really helps us. He's a good healer. He's apparently a genius at what he does, so we fit into our party really well. Um party growing strong. Party's gonna be so strong endgame. Um just like the hero's party. And yeah. He seems cool, he fits into the, the, the dynamic really well, he kind of gets on fans' nerves, just as uh, Stark does, but uh, probably for different reasons. I think she's uh, developing a little something, something for Stark. Um, yeah, good episode though, and I'm looking forward to seeing how this goes. He said he's only going to be joining up temporarily, but I hope he joins up, like, more permanently, I guess. That'd be really cool. Um, but yeah, anyway guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. <laughs> Classic hater. Oh, this is the same place. <laughs> what are you doing to Stark now? Oh, it's Fern's birthday today. Yeah, but you didn't know it was his birthday until Free Rent told you. <laughs> I mean, that's true. Stark didn't realize. I mean, Fern, did you tell people it was your birthday, like? Oh, it's going to be a Fern Stark episode. It's not like Stark even wanted a present in the first place. He was happy to get one. I bet he just didn't even know it was your birthday. Oh, spoilers. <laughs> Accustomed you seem to the company of women, so what? That makes sense. Choose the butterfly one, that was nice. <laughs> he doesn't. <laughs> I like this guy already. He's, he seems like a valuable, valuable member to the party. People in anime always do that not looking back wave. <laughs> I'm gonna start doing that in real life. Why did he just walk away without talking to anybody? See you later. <laughs> Aww. Cute. Nice. Apologizing to each other. Good job. <laughs> True. I thought they were going to hold hands there. Oh my god. Too early. Too early for that. <laughs> yeah, random free run on the roof. Uh, random, yeah, okay. Sure. Um, does that apply to free run? I think free range just figuring out relationships. <laughs> yeah, she doesn't get it. It's hard for her to get it. She's an elf. Oh, I hate her. <laughs> oh, he's such a noble guy who's done so much good for the world, and free rent only remembers him like this. <laughs> I mean, he did good. He 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 did a good life, you know. This man has got a soft sp spot in heaven. Probably drinking with God. Lots of praise and guidance. Oh, oh I hope Bro got his reward. Oh. <laughs> This old granny giving you head pats. Me next rerun. I want a head pat. <laughs> what is this? What is grandma doing? <laughs> Me for real. Oh, is he going to get her a bracelet too? Cute. 29 years after the death of the Himalaya and the band was located in the Normal Lands. Got it. An accessory shop, Celeste. 
Oh, she got a cute one. Stock just got like a band, but I guess he likes it. Oh yeah, the ring that was in her case. <laughs> this bitch needs to organize her shit. <laughs> Let's get you a file cabinet in there. What the fuck? What? Whoa! I just blinked. What the fuck? Yeah, oh, wow. <laughs> I thought I got hit by a fucking meteor or something. The horse! Oh, God. <laughs> Only 40 years. Wow. That's crazy. Are they saying they don't have the facilities to make shit like this fly yet? Ah, okay. So what if we let the carriage drop and then before it hits the ground you hit fly? Will that work? The horse though. <laughs> you're pretty sure? I'm pretty sure you're strong as hell. He went- <laughs> Oh my god, they fucking kill me. He went head first. Bro, Height has got some shit going on with Aizen. I was in the back and now this. That's what I said, yeah. Uh, okay. I guess it's happening now. Damn. Oh shit, let's go free run. Oh my god. It's worth a shot, otherwise your friends are dead. <laughs> Look at her. Bro, Saints like, I'm so done with this. <laughs> Did we do it? Did it work? Is the horse alive? Oh my god, look at it just hanging out the back. The horse is levitating. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Great landing. What do you mean by actually fixing this carriage? Hello? Any <laughs> okay. Where's the ring? Did you lose it? Three hours choosing a gift. Wow. Oh. <laughs> oh, bros. Stark needed this. Oh god, that sounds horrible. <laughs> it is nice. A mirrored Lotus? Oh, what? Oh, wait. So Himo gave that to Free Run as well. You think I know the language of flowers? <laughs> well, you didn't know it. I find that cute that, that that design is what Himel got free run. Meaning like he knew the language of flowers as well. Why is this small granny doing manual labor? She ain't built for this. Yeah, you just bonked him on the head. Why do you sleep like that? What is wrong with you? <laughs> I mean, extra warm for Fern, I guess. It's like a, a weighted blanket. Damn, I hope she finds this ring again. Is she not- does she not understand the significance of it? Oh, I bet he did. Oh, nice! That's awesome. I want to see the scene where Himo gives her this ring. I bet it was- I bet it's a good scene. Ask and ye shall receive, I guess. <laughs> he's like, he sounded so disappointed. He know what it is. He knows. Oh wow, that's awesome. Need that for like, finding my phone and shit, finding the TV remote, you know. No fucking way. <gasps> This makes me so fucking sad. Oh, Hemel was such a goat, man. 
And she didn't even know. She didn't even know he was asking her to marry him. Oh. He's like, I'm never going to be able to get to ask this properly. So let me just do it like this. Let me do it properly. <laughs> you didn't know either. <laughs> you do it. <laughs> right, so that was Free Ren Beyond Journey's End, episode 14. Very good episode. I really enjoyed that. Um, it was lovely to see not only the... Between Stark and Fern, like, getting the bracelet, then not fully understanding it, but it might, you know... It's, it's looking like it. It might uh, lead to something in the future uh, between the two of them, which I ship it. I ship it. They're the same age. They're cute for each other. They're strong. I think they'd be really nice together. But um, we also get to see... I mean, it's sad to think about, but we get to see that lovely moment between Himel and Frida and in the past. And it was just, oh, Himel, the man that you were. God. I wish they had more time together. I wish... But he then kind of understood what these moments meant. I mean, it meant to like him and everyone else. Yeah, I know it's it put, the point of the series is she's learning about this stuff later in life, and it sucks. But yeah, what a great scene, great episode. I'm definitely looking forward to the next. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction. Have a nice rest of your day, and peace out. <laughs>